So when you compare this, uh, um, Artie Wilson, he compared, uh, he did a comparison, 29 kings with archaeological corroboration, and it revealed the following. The Bible precisely matched archaeological artifacts in both the names and chronological order of the kings. Secular historian records seldom match names precisely, and I kind of, I'm almost being generous by saying seldom. I mean, it was hardly ever. If you had some secular source and then they dug up archaeology, they had the name spelled wrong or something. The Bible always had it right. And here's what Dr. Wilson said, that, that the Hebrew writers should have translated these names with such accuracy and conformity to philological principles is a wonderful proof of their thorough care and scholarship and of their access to the original sources, that the names should have been transmitted to us through so many copies in so many centuries in so complete a state of preservation is a phenomenon unequaled in the history of literature. Luke was a first-rank historian. Governors mentioned by Luke that many historians never believed existed were confirmed by the evidence excavated by Sir William Ramsey's archaeological team. Sir William Ramsey started out as an unbeliever, and he went to uh, the Middle East and became a believer. So Luke, without a single error, he was accurate in naming 32 countries, 54 cities, and nine islands. Here's what Sir William Ramsey said. I began with a mind unfavorable to it, but more recently I found myself brought into contact with the Book of Acts as an authority for the topography, antiquities, and society of Asia, Major, Asia Minor. It was gradually borne upon me that in various details the narrative showed marvelous truth. Luke is a historian of the first rank. Not merely are his statements of fact trustworthy, this author should be placed along with the very greatest historians. So he was moved by the evidence. Nelson Gluck said, it may be clearly stated categorically that no archaeological discovery has ever controverted a single biblical reference. Scores of archaeological findings have been made which confirm in clear outline or exact detail historical statements in the Bible. 